I think it's important that we start with context when it comes to a career. So there's two things you have to take into account. There's the things you love, which are your passions, and then there's the day job, the thing that pays the bills. Now, when it comes to choosing your career or the thing that you do, often you do your nine to five to pay for your passions um, and to support your passions. And sometimes, most of the time, these things are at wit's end with each other. And often what happens is someone gets so tired of their day job that they resign and they jump off the cliff and they follow their passion. It's a highly risky move and sometimes does pay off. However, when it comes to me, I think that that is bad advice. I think what you should be doing is looking at what you're really good at and looking at your passions and how you can bring them closer together. And after working hard at it for a couple of years, I can finally say I think I have successfully brought those two worlds together in my life. If you've been following my journey, you kind of know what my day job is, what I do from a nine to five. And if you know anything about me, I get very passionate about ideas, specifically anyone that has a dream. Morning meetings done for the day. Now it is finally time to get this haircut. It's been getting out of control for far too long now. Haircut, that is much better, I think. Okay, so back to it. What does it mean for this channel going forward and for you as a viewer? For the first time in a very long time, I can finally start creating content that aligns to actually what I do every day. And I can start sharing some of that knowledge with you guys and to hopefully help you along your journey too. And what I mean by that is basically everyone has an idea or has a business idea that they want to create or go forward with, but they don't know how to actually bring it to life. And that's where hopefully I will try and help. I will share some thoughts, some methodologies, some proven methodologies and ways to actually successfully launch products or turn an idea into a business and to do it quickly and on a budget which I'm very excited to share finally and I have the platform to do that. Overdose, slow, dope, don't choke This lucid psychosis, kitty cat broke Dip, peeking out slow, get the most so flocious We about both keep it free. If you're a frequent viewer of this vlog You'll realize recently there hasn't been as many drone videos as there normally is And that's because I've been having a series of unfortunate events with my drone a few weeks ago, um, I decided to fly in some very, very heavy winds that resulted in an accident and broke a few props, however, not the drone itself. However, after that, what happened is we had this massive heat wave and actually what happened is what I learned is that drone batteries are not that great and they expand in heat, resulting in my batteries looking like this. If you can see, they have bloated significantly and now they can't even fit on the drone and there's exposed battery over there which is definitely not usable i have one left in which it is bulging quite significantly but i think it does fit 
in the drone. It hopefully won't fall out. And that's what we're gonna test now. Breathing, keep it dark, we could spark trees and I won't see me. We could catch feelings, speak about dreams and the world so free. Speak about you and me oh so deeply. So we made it to Maiden's Cove. However, there's quite a bit of a breeze here, as you can see by my hair. And judging by my recent track record with the drone, I can't say I'm too comfortable to fly it high, but I might just do some low flying maneuvers within the rocks uh, just to get some footage at least. I kick it up, fuck mad shit, kicking up, speakers freak it easy on my plastic, bad shit with true feet and breezy on the couch at the back of the room, we can practice some black tricks and magical moves and pull focus and focus the walls, breathe sweat, tap the lotus up, let it flow slowly while I open up, broken up, tonguing out my name on some thug shit, you could be the future that I fuck with. Success. Thank you for watching and I'll see you soon. Twelve past twelve, I put my face on your face too. I'ma tie you up and then I break you. Snipping more fancy, future fantastic. Waste the mad swimmers on your back and break plastic. Fucking with your stupid black magic. I'ma freak you. We could both play easy, but 